Hello and welcome to this tutorial on configuring Tractor Pro 2 for the DJ Control Instinct controller by Hercules. The first thing you want to do is to open your web browser and go to ps.hercules.com. You have to choose your language, click on updates and downloads, DJ slash music, controller with audio, scroll down to DJ Control Instinct and choose drivers. From here you can download the OS X drivers or the Windows drivers. Afterwards you have to click on MIDI mapping and download the MIDI profiles for Tractor Pro 2. Next you have to install the drivers. You can do so by clicking on this file and you will find your control panel in Applications, DJ Hercules Mix, DJ Series, DJ Control Instinct, Control Panel, and DJ Instinct Control Panel. Here you have to check that the headphone channels are the 3 and 4. Now you have to open the MIDI Profiles zip file, where you can see you have the Mac and the PC version and also the instructions for the Mac and PC version. Now you have to open Tractor, where you will have to skip the setup wizard. This is because the app doesn't have native configuration from, for the Hercules controller, so you have to click Next, Next, and always Next to skip the configuration. Automatically the preferences window will open up and you have to click on import and choose the TSI file based on your operating system. From here you will be prompted to choose what kind of settings you want to import. You will go for all of them. And you can see that the layout has already changed. Now you have to verify some things. The first one is that the selected audio device is the Hercules DJ Control Instinct. And you have to remember to connect your speakers to the console and not to your computer. Then you have to verify that the output monitor, that is what we, you will hear in your headphones, is on channels 3 and 4. Finally, you have to go to Controller Manager, verify that the selected device is the DJ Control Instinct, and that the import is the uh, MIDI USB device. Now you can close your preferences, and as you can see, I am now controlling the app using my controller. That is all, thank you for watching and see you next time.